how does new scientific research get from here to there? Let's take a look behind the scenes. Every week, Nature receives around 200 online submissions. That works out to more than 10,000 manuscripts submitted every year. And Nature's team of in-house editors carefully considers each paper they receive. The most promising papers then pass through a rigorous peer review process, where international experts assess their novelty, validity, and significance. They often recommend revisions or additional analysis, and the editors work closely with the scientists and reviewers to improve the paper. Around 8% of submitted papers pass peer review and are selected by Nature's editors for publication. Once a paper is accepted, it goes into production, where a lot of things happen to it at once. Sub-editors make sure that every detail in the paper is perfect and that the scientific arguments are made clearly. Art directors design and customize the pictures and graphics. For some papers, leading scientists are commissioned to write additional commentary and analysis on the research, while the multimedia team records podcasts and shoots videos. And within a few weeks, the paper is finished and ready for the most important part of its life, publication. Nature's marketing and press teams publicize the research and organize press conferences to announce especially significant findings. The paper is also published digitally on mobile devices such as smartphones and tablets. And as always, it appears on Nature's website, which gets almost 8 million page views per month. But the life of a paper doesn't end there. Nature's focus on high-quality research means that the paper is read by many other scientists who will use the findings to inspire even more new research. Soon enough, the original paper gets cited in new ones. And its life goes on. <laughs>